Good afternoon everyone, this is Kimmy Kim and I have another haul for you today. Um, I wanted to see if I could be on top of things at Tuesday morning and be there when they get their shipment. <laughs> well, they got their shipment this morning, but they weren't unpacking it. So they told me to come back in a couple days, so I will try again in a couple days, but I didn't leave empty handed. So you know me, I gotta find something. Can't go, can't leave without without something. So, I did find, you know, they said they don't get shipments, but I go in quite a bit and I saw some new things. Let me dig in my bag. And you know I go in the same section, but uh, whatever, I'm glad. I know, I know, I know, I already had a couple hauls on Halloween stuff, but this little tablet, <laughs> The Haunted Hollow by American Crafts, is just too adorable. It's just too darn cute. It has, oops, I have it backwards. Okay, let's try this again. It has like a craft paper and it's it's hard to explain how it feels. It's not it's not like your regular cardstock. It's actually it's thick like cardstock, but it's soft where the print is. So that was really cute, the orange, the wood, some spiders and some drawing or not drawing, some script. And these little books chemistry and these are really cute. Oh, those will be really cute just to cut them out and use them. Um, that one, some bats, black one, some spiders. My favorite, huh? Not. <laughs> Let's see, some numbers, some little ads, and this print is so cute. I don't know if you can see it well enough. I'm going to try to raise this up, but I use a um, tablet for my camera, so we'll see uh, how this works. I don't know if you can see the little pumpkins in there. Very cool, though. Cool little design with the little pumpkins. And a fence, like an iron fence. And polka dots. And then this one has the bats in it instead of the pumpkins. And the reverse, the black with the orange. And this is really cute. Potions and botanicals. Account name, invoice, order number, and deductions. That is really neat. And some words. Halloween words. Uh, Jack-o-lantern, happy Halloween, caution, trick-or-treat, stuff like that. Some stars. This is like craft paper with black. I like the crow, the spooky crow, trick or treat, happy Halloween. I liked this. Um, I, you know, I like my other papers that I that I got as well, like at Hobby Lobby and Joann's. But um, but I really liked this set. The other ones were a little more, I don't know, more playful maybe. Maybe that's the word I'm looking for. Oh look, and this one has bats instead of pumpkins. Wait, did the other one have bats too? I'm losing my mind. I think it did. I just told y'all what it was. Yeah, it was bats, but it was a different pattern. This has orange. I knew it looked familiar. And then it repeats. So I'm really liking that. I'm, I'm visioning the book now. <laughs> <laughs> so that was $6.99, regularly $14.99, and the number on there is 1848101, and I'll set that aside. I did get a couple things that weren't Halloween, but only a couple. <laughs> I got these. These are little rub-offs by Little B, and they weren't there. I didn't see them, uh, but they did clean. Everything was really organized, so maybe, you know, they were in a different spot or something. 
But um, these little ribops are really cute. I guess there's 18 of them. Boo, Trick or Treat, Witches Brew, Spooky, Eek, Zombies, Haunted House, Scary, Jack-O-Lantern. And that was just 79 cents. And that number, let's see if y'all can read it, 1802945. We'll see how this works. I'll keep experimenting with the numbers, number calling out, and um, see what best works with my camera. And this one's cute by Remarks. The little, the little puffy stickers. And I love the cats and the owls and the bats. And you know that I love my stickers, so. And boy, do I love stickers. Wait till you get a load of the ones I got today. <laughs> These puppy stickers were $1.49, regularly $3.99. And American Crafts Remarks. And there's the tag. It's 1848121. Okay. I got a couple more Tim Holtz. And I have seen this one, and I couldn't decide if I wanted it, and I grabbed it today. I, I don't usually, I, I'm, I get the stickers, but I don't get the rub, the rub-offs. But I really liked what was in here. So with the clock and the, I love that, the, with the butterflies and the balloon and the hand, and it's just all, it's all good. <laughs> it's all good. So I grabbed it, and, um, oops. You hear my cat. Tatsu's at it again. <laughs> so if you hear a rustle, she might come trotting by. And that would be Tatsu, my uh, my other half. <laughs> These were one ninety nine, regularly four ninety nine, and that number is one eight eight zero zero nine two. Okay got another Tim Holtz. This wasn't there. And I really thought this was cool uh, to use for many things, actually. But Tuck Pocket comes to mind and, um, and co on covers of books and what have you. I don't know. Can y'all hear my cat? <laughs> she's meowing at birds. Sorry, she's distracting me. And this was only $7.99. And it's compared usually fifteen ninety nine, so I grabbed that. And uh, Tatsu, Tatsu, come say hi. And that number is one eight five two seven nine eight. There's a bird outside, and it's driving her bonkers. These I got. These are these are kind of cool. They're decoupage paper. I'm going to open it and see. Boy, I don't know how. Let me get some scissors or something. Oh, it just pulls with the help of some scissors. I swear I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Okay, there we go. A little backwards there. Oh, these are nice. They're real nice. It's different than tissue paper or napkin. Um, it's kind of like... Hmm. How do I explain it? Well, what's it made out of? That'll help us. Does it tell us? No. Doesn't say. Well, it's not a um, tissue paper. It's much thicker than a tissue paper. And much, much thick, thicker than a napkin. But it's really nice. I like it. The, the uh, script here. And then the notes there. And these colors are really pretty. So I like that. And that decoupage paper was regularly $5.50, and I got it for $1.99. If 
by Deco Art. I think I said that. Americana. I don't know which. Are they the same? <laughs> I, I have uh, Americana paint, but now they're Deco Art, so I get, to, I get it all confused. And here's another one that I grabbed. And just, you know, basic black and white. So that'll go with a lot. And I like this with the cameos and the keys. And then there's script, print. It's really nice. You know what it feels like? It feels like newspaper. It's a little thicker than newspaper. So the one with the keys and the cameo, uh, regularly $5.50, it's $1.99 also. And that number is 1839217. And the other one, that number was 1839211. And they had several other um, prints. Okay, is that all that I got it? Tuesday morning? Now this probably won't be the last you see of me this week um, with Tuesday morning. I'm going to give them a day. Maybe go tomorrow morning. Maybe go the next morning. Give them a day or two to, to unpack everything. I'm just, I always miss the boat <laughs> right when they get in. I, I never time it right. And I always oh, seem like I feel like I, I just miss stuff because I watch other hauls and I see things that aren't at my Tuesday morning. So, I mean, I know everyone's different, but then later I'll see it at my Tuesday morning. So I don't know, maybe, maybe the timing's just, just off. So at any rate, I am going to uh, be a little shopaholic this week and try and catch it so I can find some goods for y'all and for me so I can uh, make my books. I did stop, and I didn't put this, actually this wasn't a plan, but Tuesday morning is next to Dollar Tree, and I only picked up a couple things, probably not even worth mentioning, but um, I, I will anyway, because I do use it for craft. I just grabbed this tablet of paper, and you know, they usually have construction paper, they have the writing paper, um, but I, I don't often see the doodle pad paper. And um, I really like the texture of it, um, so I grabbed that because that'll be a really nice coffee dive. And um, obviously that was a dollar for 60 sheets. And here was a new um, organizer that I hadn't seen before in our store. And um, you know, I, was, I have an abundant amount of paper clips. <laughs> paper clips and beads and... Um, I really need to get my paper clips in order, so I've, I have had look, have been looking for containers, and I spotted this one, and uh, yesterday I found a really nice one that was quilted. Um, it's, in, it's in one of my haul videos. It's really pretty. And I just grabbed some rubber bands. You always need some rubber bands. So that was it for the dollar store. That was an easy trip. Now, I'll explain to you <laughs> without getting into great detail. I wanted to go to Michael's. Now, I don't go to Michael's very often because it's 30 minutes away and I really don't like driving that far. I live in a little village town and everything is here. I like it. And I don't have I don't have to go anywhere. <laughs> it's only like maybe 15 minutes outside the village to get anywhere, so I I enjoy that. So I I just decided I want to see the, this Halloween um, Tim Holtz um, inventory that I've seen on other hauls. Like um, I'm a cool mom. She went. She she saw it all at the Michaels that she went to. So you know I. I was like, you know, I have enough, I have enough things for Halloween already. This is ridiculous, but I really love Tim Holtz and I wanted, I wanted to see it. So I took the trip, went to Michael's and wouldn't you know, they don't carry it. <laughs> I ran my little booty to the aisle, 
found it right away. They, they do have a whole lot of fur selection. They do. But they didn't have not one Halloween thing. Nothing. Not a witch's broom. Not a charm. Not a skull. <laughs> nothing. But, and I asked the lady and she said they just didn't get any in. So, I don't know. That's weird. But I didn't leave empty handed. I Since I don't go to Michael's, I saw lots of little you know, different brands of things that I don't normally see at Joann's or Hobby Lobby. So I grabbed a few things and I'll share that with you. Now I grabbed these because, now I know you're probably thinking, well you make journals, so why are you buying journals? <laughs> and I asked myself the same question, but um, I plan to uh, cover these on the inside because it's all that craft uh, paper and um, do my own deal to it you know make it make it my own thing and um, give them as gifts so I thought that would be nice and so I just grabbed these two different colors I wish that I had had gotten the planner though to add to it but I didn't I just grabbed these these are just plain plain paper but you know, if I if I punch the corners and I put a couple stamps in here and I either I can paint it with acrylic paints or I can use um, use you know paper and cover it up. Of course, not the cover cover, just the inside because this is really nice. So that I thought was a little treasure. They weren't very expensive. They weren't more than twelve dollars, I don't think. And unfortunately, Michaels doesn't um, have a price tag on anything, which was a little frustrating. But um, so I'm I'm probably not going to know the prices on some of this stuff for y'all. But I'll just share with you what I got. Now these I thought were really cute. Um, recollections. Now I don't see a lot of recollections. Mm -hmm. Hobby Lobby I think sometimes gets it. Not a whole lot of it though. And um, I really liked some of their some of their stuff. I had a lot of the floral, but I'm gonna open this. I can do it without wounding myself. Okay. Pull these out. There. Now we can see them. These are gonna be so much fun. And. Um, plan on using them if they're not too big. Um, there is a sweet friend on Instagram who requested me to do a tutorial on these tags that I make and um, so I, I'll be doing that probably this week sometime. But I thought these would be really cute to put on them and um, I love purple. And you know, the white and gold goes with everything. And this off creamy color. So, a pack of 24 for those. Okay. And of course, I got these. And I just love KNC Company. Whenever I, whenever I see them, I, I try and grab their stuff. Um, because I just, I like all of it. I don't think they have anything that I don't like. So I'm just going to open these to show you how nice they are. They are so, the quality is just awesome. They're just three-dimensional. Um, let's see. There's another one. There's another one. I'm going to use these like crazy. And especially on my, um, on my tags. These are going to be awesome. So that was a good deal. That was worth driving out there. Let's see if there's some smaller ones in here too. Hopefully y'all can see this I'm in the frame. Let's see and what this set is. This set is the purple. This was more pinky, mauve, and green and yellow. Well, heck. I didn't do that right.
Nothing like people watching you struggle opening something. <laughs> it's so embarrassing. We'll do it together. There we go. Now these are really cute too. That one's bent, but we can bend it back. Purple, and white, and this is great. It's got the root right on it. Oh, I love it. Look at that. Oh, I love them. These are just great. I'm so glad I got them. So, that is that for the K&C company. I'm running out of room here. And I have to admit, I did get a lot. But they had a good sale going on. They had buy two, get one free. So, where do I begin? I'll begin with... Let's see. This was on sale. Tim Holtz. Whenever I see these, I grab them because sometimes I use them on my books. And uh, it was on sale for $4.99. I'm not sure what they regularly are, but Tim Holtz on sale. I'm going to grab it. So that was that. I got this Tim Holtz. I'm going to open this one too so you can see what kind of ephemera it is. And this was just like, oh wow, there's like a bunch of stuff in here. It's called Thrift Shop. Oh, I like the clock. A oh, little ticket, little chip, photo album. Oh, these are cute. Alphabet, coat sizes, <laughs> cards. Oh, I like these. I like them because they're bigger. I have some packs and I probably just bought the wrong ones because the stuff is just too small. Here's a calendar. Periodic table of the elements. This is awesome. Dressmaking. Very cool stuff. So that's that. You get the gist. A postcard. Everything in here is really pretty cool. That's one of my favorites. I like that. Looking for a stamp like that. Haven't found one. I'm on a mission, so if any of you know of stamps that are similar to that, if you could leave it in my comments, that would be awesome. I would so appreciate that. Because I've been looking around here and I can't find anything like that. Not one that's a corset, not like one that's like a mannequin. Um, haven't found any stamps like that at all. Okay, and here's one more Tim Holtz. And I uh, just got some more stickers of the words. I like the words. Um, uh, I think I got the black ones, the darker colored ones at Tuesday morning and then Michael's had this light version. So, I grabbed that. My sweetheart artist, just at this moment. Little things. Remembrance of the things to come. It was nice, so I grabbed that. Here's, here's some more ephemera. This one's by Art. And it's book pages. I won't go through all of them because we'll be here forever, but um, just a little peek at what kind of book pages they are. It could be anything. Let's see. Oh, maps. Okay. A lot of maps. Railway. Just really cute ephemera. I like it. Paris. A lot of Paris. Let's see, these bigger ones. A lot about Paris. That must be the theme. Oh, that's Central Park. Asia. Just a lot of maps. Very cool. 
I think the rest are all Ireland. That's really cool. It's like a lot of countries in here. That's nice. And I know I didn't spend much on it because I don't spend I don't spend regular price for one unless well if I have a coupon obviously, but um, very rarely. These were were now remember these were all buy two get one free. So as I pull these out of the bag, it's going to look like I have more than I, well, it's going to look like a lot, <laughs> but I didn't pay that much. So these were cute, these little envelopes, just little bitty envelopes. There's 16 pieces in here. Let's see, three, six, nine, plus the papers that are inside it. That's really cute. And this... I loved and I wish they had more they only had this one and I fell in love with this these are so nice the fabric frames let's see well well you can see that one that one's square this one's oval it's just so nice I like it for um you know the vintage stuff it's nice I got a few things by Seven Gypsies, and this I just thought was was cute. It's like um, it's the paper of a pattern. Um, oh, I'll take it. What the heck? We'll take it out. But be nice to decoupage with it. It's really cool. I'm loving it even more. I'm glad I'm opening it. <laughs> you just cut them out. You can just cut different things out and use them. They're great images. Love them. Love, love, love. See, much cooler taking it out. The only thing that I could see was this little bit on the outside. So that was one of the uh, buy two, get, get one free. Now this was just on sale for $5.99. It was in the clearance, and I don't have these these stamps. And these are really cute. I like this corner here and the bird branch script. Well, all of it's really cute. So $5.99 for that. Okay, now the rest is all sticker of some sort. <laughs> I got some washi tape that has uh, stamps on it. They're so cute. Rome, airmail, love that. So cute. I like that. I got these by um, Seven Gypsies. And I'll be real honest, I didn't know what they were. I figured, hey, they're probably stickers. Um, I knew it was an embellishment of some kind, but it wasn't until I got home. And I, I just liked the images that they were. Because again, this is similar to the stamp I'm looking for. This is really puffy and um, <laughs> it feels so cool. But it's not, it's not a sticker. It's just, I don't think, maybe it is. <gasps> I'm bad, it is a sticker. Now, see, I couldn't... See, we figured it out together. <laughs> oh, I feel silly now. This one with the clock. I could have sworn these were not stickers. But they're still... Now it makes it even cooler because you don't have to glue them or anything. They just, like, go on. And with the clock, I like that. These are little bottles. I love the Seven Gypsy line, and I don't, I don't really see much of it around here. Those are really cute. I don't know if you can see. Oh, and I didn't use my yucky, dirty mat, art mat today. I put some muslin there for you, and that one, the sewing machine. Cute. Those were cute. And those were, you know, buy two, get one free. 
Now here were a bunch of Jolies. They don't have a lot of Jolies at the Hobby Lobby near me. Um, and they are so cute. <laughs> More Halloween, but nothing like the other ones I have. I know, there's so many, such a variety, but so much fun. So much fun. So these, you know, they're three-dimensional. Happy Halloween, Trick or Treat, and Boo. And these were really cute. The little spider's eyeballs move. And then the spider webs. Those are just thought those were really cute. I got two. Two of these. Happy Halloween. This one I liked with the house and the gravestones and everything. That was pretty cool. And I just love these. <laughs> These little dress-up, posable pumpkin head guys. And the black cat. Now these move, I think. I don't know. Now I feel like I'm wrong on something. I got the, the stickers wrong. Let's see. They say movable. Yeah, the legs move. Cute. The legs move. Makes it even cuter. Because then you can fit it on your page how you want it. Oh, trick or treat, I love it. So cute. Too stinking cute. I did get a couple other things now that were just from for fall. Oh, fiddlesticks. Get that. Okay. This one's the autumn one. And I like the wreath and the corn and everything. And that was really nice. And stickers are expensive. So buy two, get one free. Heck yeah. And the half offs when you go to Hobby Lobby. Those are, that's the time to get them. But again, like these, these um, Jolie ones, I, we don't have that brand. Now these are so pretty. Um, they have butterflies. There's some glitter in there. Um, the flowers, the birds. They're really pretty. Dimensional stickers as well. So I really like those. Again, by Recollections. Really enjoying those. Now I know what everyone's talking about when they say Recollections, how, how nice their things are. This one's by Paper House, and it's also like three-dimensional. And this tree is just awesome. It really sticks up. And... Uh, the little sign with the metal, metal little thing there, leafing around. <laughs> it's cute. So that is that. And I think, I think that's today's haul, y'all. <laughs> um, I will probably be back a little later today or tomorrow with another haul. Um, I still have my Christmas haul to put together. It's just a little pre-Christmas haul. Someone had requested I go to Hobby Lobby and take a peek at what they had. So I did that and, you know, came home with a bag full of stuff. Stickers and whatnot. So um, some cute things that I will show you later. But I do want to take a moment and um, before I say goodnight, I want to um, send blessings and healing and love out there to everyone with this bad weather. We've got hurricanes going on. We've got fires across the country, um, you know, here in the U.S. And, you know, what's happened to Houston. I have family in Houston. I have my daughter in Seattle where the fires are. Uh, my mother and sister in Houston where the floods are. Um, it, it's just, it's all over the place. And it's not just my family. It's it's many people's family. It's, it's a lot of people. Ooh, it makes me teary right now. But, um, I, I want to send some love out there, and I just want to thank y'all for taking the time to watch me today. And we will see you next time shopping. Have a good night. Take care.